Today I flubbed up, by missing a full flight. Rewind to yesterday, my grandpa and I are flying to Tucson from Indianapolis. First flight turned out good, even got to our layover in Dallas early enough to get wrapped up in a good DS game for me, and a book for him. Fast forward an hour and they've switched gates on us, I realized this at 10 minutes till boarding time I run over there immediately and realize that it's already departed. Great. Now, given that my grandpa's a well-respected professor, he's still got some issues with situational awareness. As do I apparently, because they called our names multiple times. After being put on standby lists for three different flights, we end up booking a discounted hotel room 12 hours later, followed by a tuna wrap from an empty subway, for each of us. In the morning, eating our continental breakfast, I realize I left my charger up in the room and hurriedly go get it before we miss the shuttle. I get back down to the lobby and see my bag, unguarded. Frantically, I search for my grandpa, knowing he can wander off, and end up finding him in the bathroom. I first notice his coat, thrown on the floor outside the stalls, followed by an overpowering stench of feces. I call for him, as the shuttle is waiting on us to leave, and receive the reply that he had an accident while sitting at the table. After 20 minutes of waiting on him to reverse the event which he referred to as filling his drawers and socks, we are shuttled to the airport, making our flight to Arizona, almost a full 24 hours later than the original, just in time. I'm now sitting next to a man on a plane who has single-handedly accomplished the feat of becoming a mobile porta potty I keep telling him and, in turn, others around that it's part of the adventure. For now, it's the recycled air that keeps the memory fresh in my mind and in my nostrils.